who's like someone that's like suave nowadays? Brad Pitt. Someone more relevant. <laughs> He's fifty. Uh, Tom Holland. Uh, I don't know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Rick Vetiver. Welcome back to another day of our fragrance journey. I hope you guys have been having a wonderful holiday season. Since we do have New Year's right around the corner, ready to wrap up the year and the holidays, I wanted to bring back another one of our fragrances and Zodiac episodes. And the next one we're gonna have up is gonna be the Capricorn sign. So I picked out a couple of fragrances that are gonna represent not only the characteristics of the Capricorn, but are also gonna play well with the weather and the time of year. So the Capricorn is described to be as an ambitious, motivated, uh, great leader of a sign. They're known to be the more mature, assertive daddy of the zodiac signs. So I'm going to bring out a couple of fragrances that are going to be a little bit more assertive and daddy-like. <laughs> so the first fragrance I'm going to suggest is going to be Prada Loam. And for me, Prada Loam is a perfect work time scent. For me, just like a Capricorn is known to be a, a great leader and someone that gets things done, this to me is for the professional. This guy can accomplish any task. So this has some lavender, iris, and cedar wood. This reminds me of my linens just hanging in the breeze near a lavender field because it's so fresh and clean and, and it's something that, that kind of wakes me up when I smell it. But the sillage is, is more on the moderate side. So like I said, it's perfect for work because it's not gonna be overwhelming, it's not gonna be loud, it's not gonna be abrasive. It's gonna be that perfect little small scent cloud that you want people to take notice while they're walking by them. Now to me, this works perfect with our cool, fresh weather that we're having. Uh, some days it's even getting a little bit of sprinkly with the, with a little bit of uh, rain. It, it gives me that envision of how, how to explain it? Like when you breathe in like a mist of, uh, uh, of rain and it almost smells refreshing and clean, that's the same vibe that I'll get from this product where it smells just so natural and so clean and I, I almost do think silvers and white in my head when I smell this and, and for me it's just the perfect imagery that I get when I'm looking at these silver clouds and this nice breezy weather that we're having. So the last suggestion that I'm going to have for the Capricorns is going to be Dior Homme Intense. Dior Homme Intense came out in 2011 and even though it has a classic vibe it still smells relevant so we're going to call it timeless. This smells like Sean Connery, James Bond in the 1960s as well as James Bond, Daniel Craig, today. Mm. This is gonna be my, and I suggest to all you Capricorns to wear this as your New Year's scent. For me, this scent is gonna fit so well, not only with the theme of New Year's, but with the, the, the feeling that you get in New Year's, that, that excitement of the future to come. This guy has iris inside of it, which is shared in lipstick. I feel like when having that New Year's kiss and wearing this particular fragrance, I'm gonna encaptivate a memory that's gonna last a lifetime. Every time I smell this, that moment will appear in my mind and I'll be teleported back to 2020 New Year's drop. So Capricorns, this video is for you. Go out and get this. James Bond has to be a Capricorn. He's assertive, he gets things done, he's a daddy, he wears suits. If you're gonna be wearing a suit and a peacoat on the New Year's drop, wear this fragrance. I promise you, everyone around you is going to appreciate it and you're gonna create memories that are gonna last a lifetime every time you smell this guy. So these two pair up perfectly together, not just because they both work perfectly in these late December and January months, but they both share very similar notes, being iris and cedarwood. Now they both go in two different directions, but I could still feel the same vibe, right? This one is definitely gonna be a little bit more for my everyday, my daytime, hardworking, and this one's definitely gonna be more of a very nice, pleasant, sexy, more assertive, fun-going type of a night. It's gonna be wonderful for either daytime or nighttime, but I definitely recommend this for the New Year's night. Capricorns, if you're one of those people that are more assertive and dominant and hardworking, you're goal-oriented, I think that you're gonna love these fragrances. I'm Rick Vetiver. Thanks so much for 
joining us for another day of our fragrance journey. I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful holiday season, and I hope you guys have a great new year. Let's get 2020 over with. Let's start a new, fresh 2021, and we are super excited here to continue pumping out brand new, more exciting content for the next year to come.